Hello guys, it's Laurie from Passionate Penny Pincher and it is day three of Croc, or I'm sorry, day eight. So we're in the second week, day three, day eight of two weeks of Croctober and we are making tonight slow cooker chicken tacos. So, and I'm also making dessert and I have a crazy, crazy deal on the Silhouette Cameo that I'm gonna tell you about. You can download your completely free menu plan, grocery list, everything you're gonna need over at passionatepennypincher.com slash Croctober. You can click a link in the um, top and we're gonna get you to that. Good morning guys, so glad to see you guys on this morning. If I could see your hearts and likes and something over here, that would be awesome. I'm back over here today. I'm probably gonna switch it around. The only reason I'm over here is my husband threw away my boxes that were holding up the camera yesterday. Okay, so we're gonna make dinner in like under five minutes. Probably we are gonna make dinner and dessert, which is pretty exciting. We have, oh, I'm so glad. Thanks for sharing those likes and shares. That makes me feel a little happier way over here. Um, there is a crazy deal on the Silhouette Cameo. I'm gonna tell you real fast about it while folks are hopping on. I don't think it's gonna last. I am gonna try to do a tutorial on this in a couple hours. I'm hoping it'll last till I have time to do it. This is currently priced at 158, I think. This is a crazy gold box deal, guys. Um, if you have been debating getting these, this is much cheaper than I paid for it. And just to give you an idea of what it makes, oh, I pulled them over here so y'all could see them. Okay, so this is my silhouette. Do y'all see these? I'm gonna show them to you. If you're an OSU, Ohio State fans, these are gonna be backwards. These are cute little headbands we made. This is a headband we made. You can make paper crafts. You can do all kinds of things with the, um, the silhouette. So it's a really fun thing. Hello, hi Lisa, so glad to see you. Yes, I did keep the sweater, good morning. Good to see you, Janice and Mark. So glad y'all are on this morning. Okay, so it makes super cute cutting things. I will do a tutorial hopefully later in the day, but I don't know that it's gonna last all day. It's a gold box deal, but it's a limited time offer. Okay, let's get cooking. So we are making slow cooker chicken tacos today and dessert because my kiddos invited a friend over for dinner, so we were trying to make something a little special. So let's see how fast we can get dinner done. And you know what? I forgot my taco seasoning package. Ugh. Oh, here it is. I think this is it. I hope that's it. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Okay. Okay, so I forgot my taco seasoning. That's awesome. I'm gonna grab one out of the pantry just to be on the safe side. Oh, I did have to do this. Okay, I cannot believe I have lost my taco seasoning and I can't believe I didn't lay out. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Okay, that's pitiful. I had a pre-made one done, but I forgot to pull it out ahead of time. So sorry guys, I didn't mean for that to be confusing. Okay, really we're gonna get dinner done fast. Let's do dinner. All you need is, and I forgot to get the salsa out. Guys, I was so worried about dessert that I forgot everything. But this is easy and we're gonna chill out together because it's one of those mornings. It has been a morning like that all day. All you're gonna do is throw your chicken. You need um, a pound and a half of froze, uh, boneless skinless chicken breast. You're gonna throw that in the crock pot. You're gonna throw your taco seasoning on top of it. I was so worried about making dessert to show you guys I got all the stuff to make the dessert and I totally was not focused on the dinner. But the dinner is so easy that, okay, so there's that. And then you're gonna add in one and a half cups of salsa, which hopefully, my son put the groceries away the other day. So you know, I don't know where anything is at. <laughs> Oh, that's funny, guys. Okay, so literally, I can't find, my son Jackson put the groceries away the other day for us um, because we told him he had to, and um, I don't know where he put the salsa. So you add on one and a half cups of salsa on top of that, pop your lid on, cook it on low for six to eight hours, you have your slow cooker, chicken taco meat, super easy. Now let's go to dessert. Oh my goodness, y'all, it has been a morning like this. Like, have you ever woken up and had one of those mornings? That was today at our house, but hopefully this recipe is gonna go a little bit easier. Okay, so the other thing we're making is no-bake chocolate eclair cake. This is the easiest and yummiest recipe ever. You're gonna love it. Um, it's super, super simple. All you need is a package of graham crackers. You need two uh, vanilla instant vanilla pudding mixes, eight ounces of Cool Whip, a thing of frosting and some milk. So we can do this. I cannot believe. Anyways, oh well, can't, it's gonna be what it's gonna be. Okay, you're gonna lay these down on the bottom of your pan. Okay, so you're just gonna layer these on the bottom. Okay, then you're gonna mix together eight ounces of Cool Whip 
So this is a little bit extra, but I'm gonna um, just kind of guesstimate that. Three cups of milk. I really can't believe I forgot all this stuff this morning. It's just, ugh. And then two uh, three ounce packages of instant vanilla pudding mix. Have any of y'all made this? Has anybody made this at Claire Cake before? A friend of mine brought this to us when we um, had one of our kids as a, she was bringing dinner to us. And it was definitely one of our favorites. Um, so yeah, we had, had to share it with y'all. It is a super, super yummy treat. And you can click the link above if you're looking for directions. Thanks for those likes and shares. I can see those way over here as y'all are watching me be a hot mess this morning. Okay, so you're gonna um, just pop these in here. Okay, so that's all we're gonna do. Then we're gonna stir this all together. is so simple thank goodness because obviously I need simple today are y'all still on with me sorry guys this is gonna be one of those crazy mornings so you're just gonna mix this really well together my Cool Whip was a little bit far from being defrosted, so I'm going to give it a good mix because I'm trying to mix in those things. If your Cool Whip is already defrosted, it'll be a little easier. Not that this is especially hard, but it will go even faster. I want to make sure to get it all mixed up real well. Okay, so once that's done, and I will tell you, this is this gets a little bit messy with the frosting, but if you've never made this, it is so, so, so good. I just wanna get this back parts mixed. Okay, this is a little bit more liquidy than I would like it to be, but since we're doing it live, I don't want y'all to have to sit here all day. It will set up in the fridge. So you're gonna pour half of that onto your graham crackers. Then you're gonna do another layer of graham crackers. which we're actually doing um, gluten-free graham crackers. Um, I got Pamela's, I think. my The friend that's coming over for dinner tonight eats gluten-free, so we were trying to think of something that was a little fun um, and different. And this actually is my son's favorite recipe, which is why I picked it. He loves this stuff. Hoping y'all can, I'm hoping y'all are still over there. I can't see from way over here, but I'm trusting y'all are there. And I didn't even try to eat one of these because I wasn't, they're expensive, and so I didn't want to waste them if we needed them all. Okay, so then you're going to pour the rest of this on top. I don't want to lose any, so I'm going to go ahead and get this and scrape it all out. The good thing about me making this live is that I'm not tempted to eat anything. The trash man is here, so my dog's having a heart attack over there. Okay, so we're going to do that. And then all you're going to do is, this is just plain old chocolate frosting. I've warmed it up for about 30 seconds. Um, and you're just going to pour, <laughs> cannot believe, y'all, this is one of those mornings. Do you ever have one of those mornings where you're like, you know, today is going to be a chaotic day. That's kind of how this is gone. So I want to do a really, hey, Summit, Summit, Summit. Come here, buddy. It's okay. Come here. It's okay. Settle down. You know how badly he would like to just jump up here and eat all of this stuff? Yeah, he would be so happy. So you're just going to put this on kind of gently um, because you don't want to mix in. Oh, my word. Let me go let him outside. Hang on. Summit, come here, buddy. Summit.
Yeah, I had to trick him outside with the frosting. I cannot believe, if anybody is watching this still today, um, yeah, yeah, bless you, it's, it's bad. Let me wash my hands super fast and then I'll finish this up. Oh, goodness, it is just one of those days. And so I know there are gonna be some comments about how unorganized I am. You know what the good thing is about it being unorganized? You can be an unorganized mess and you can still at least get dinner on the table. So amazingly, somehow things get done around here despite my mess, which I think is God's grace just covering the disaster that I am. <laughs> okay. You just wanna go slow with this because you don't want to mix in. You wanna kinda of keep it, you want a nice topping. Um, so that's why I'm not just, you have to kind of go slow. And then it will, you're going to let it refrigerate and then as it sets up, it's going to, all of this will set up and it will be like the yummiest thing. I'm going to come show it to you guys. You can see how sloppy this is, but I promise, obviously you can't mess up a tub of frosting and a bunch of graham crackers and some pudding. This is so easy, so, so simple, but so good. And you can get the recipe over at passionatepennypincher.com in the link above the video. I'm gonna come show this to you guys. And you can also see what it's gonna look like. I'll try to bring over a picture. Here's this. Okay, are y'all ready? Here we go. Okay, so there it is. Y'all see that? Yeah, it's real life. Thank you guys for being so sweet about, I definitely need some God's grace this morning because it is, like I said, I woke up this morning, it was crazy like this all day long. So I'm going to um, show y'all real fast. You can download this for free. I'm also going to show you the silhouette really quickly one more time. You can get all of these deals at Passionate Penny Pincher. We have lots of other deals going on this morning. I just haven't even gotten to those. I will show y'all this, this again. Okay, so this is that silhouette cameo. It will cut anything. So if you do craft projects, if you do any projects like that, I'll bring it over here so you can see it. Um, it's going to be on sale. It's two day only. It's one fifty eight. It is by far the best price you've ever seen. I've seen on it ever. It's cheaper than I bought it for. I love mine. I'm going to try probably in a couple hours, maybe around noon to do a really quick, um, tutorial and I'll show you kind of how to make something. I'm hoping, I think I have some etching cream. So I'm going to see if I can show you a Dollar Tree etching cream project. We'll see how good I get. As you can tell today has not been a normal morning. So y'all thank you so much for your patience with me this morning. As I know I've been a hot mess. Um, but I appreciate that. I know y'all are with me and I'm not the only one. We all have those days. So hope you guys have a fantastic morning. I'll scoot over here. Hope you have a fantastic, fantastic morning. Share this if you know someone else who would love to get dinner on the table and download your free cookbook. Have a great morning, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.